And I told her, I said, the Spirit of the Lord <laughs> told me to See. quit my job. See. Hey, guys. Hello, everyone. Man, I know that you guys are doing great, right? I know y'all doing good. Yes. Yeah. We have a video that we want to react with you guys. Let's hit this. Yes. You ready? I'm excited. Let's hit it. My job was about 150 grand. In the 90s. In the 90s. Oh, you're rich, rich. That's fat. <laughs> My base salary was around eighty thousand. Oh Jesus Christ, I had, Lord, uh, blue, all of that. Thinking yeah. about you, it. You, you're loving that lifestyle, wasn't you, Grandma Linda? So what? <laughs> you gonna really love this? I came home anointed, and I told her, I said, the Spirit of the Lord <laughs> told me to See? quit my job See? and See that? pass the full time. See that? I want somebody in and the you know audience what she told to me? say, you know what this what preacher's daughter. The safety woman of God told me. I love them. Uh, I know. Uh, he felt it that uh, he got a, all of a sudden, the he got a spirit call. Spirit of the Lord. The spirit of the Lord said. told him. And the, 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 the wife over there, like, remembering the day, the time, like, you tried to take me back. Oh, my God. As far as I want to say is that we, um, we never heard of them before. This yeah. is our first time. Uh, watching them so we don't know much about them but right <laughs> off I want to give them some compliments I think she looks great I don't yes. know how old she is but from top to bottom she she looks very very beautiful the husband uh, listen I love how he's very hip in his words Yeah, he's like that's facts <laughs> <laughs> so man 150 back in those days I know it's still a lot of money you're not gonna tell me you, you gotta call it but I'm just saying. <laughs> what she said? She said, go back and talk to him again. I God did not tell you that. Okay. Uh-uh. God did not tell you that. <laughs> I felt, oh, my God. 150000 a year. Then, uh, and she living great. She believe everything is awesome. Yes. Then all of a sudden, he want to take her backward. You need to talk to God. You need to stop this. Because ministry, obviously, me and my husband are in ministry, right? It does not come with money. Yeah. It does not come with money. Um, Only if you want to be a scammer. Yeah, only if you want to be a prosperity preacher, enticing war, lying to people. It's the only way you can be rich in ministry. But if you're just doing it with your whole heart, you know, and let people freely give, it doesn't come with money. It really don't. So I would say <laughs> and, and by watching this that, you know, she knows that if she going to do a ministry, <laughs> she going to do it right. And yeah. she don't want her husband to quit her job, yeah, his for job that. Yeah. for that. Yeah. I totally agree with her on that. I have oh to be my honest God. with you. Like, Ooh, yes. You need to go back and talk to the Lord. Yes. <laughs> I know That's a that fact. you are hearing from yourself because <laughs> God <laughs> want me to be able to shop and travel. What are you talking? I had so many conflicted. You talk about what happened. This kind of foolishness went on in our house. Well, he told me I'm quitting my job. I'm coming home and I'm going to be a full-time pastor. I said, oh, 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 oh. How many members you got? Oh, no. Child by Child. <laughs> How many members you got? And I uh, and I'm gonna pay for tithes and offering. <laughs> oh my goodness. I like her. I like her a lot. Oh my god, like what are you talking about? Like how many members are we talking about? Yes, I know some people might not agree with her. Yeah. You know, a lot of people are gonna be like, No, you know, what if the Lord was speaking to him? You know, the thing is, if they're in marriage, yeah. they're, God consider them as one. Yes. The wife is not in agreement. Yeah. So then if he would have quit his job without her being in agreement, they would have got a divorce. Yeah. And then it would have caused a delay on their ministry as well. Now, I don't know if they're in ministry now, you know, but a man can have a job and still be in ministry. I'm pleased. A, a woman yeah. can have a job and still be in ministry. I don't know why. Um, is getting to that point in this world that we see ministers or pre- preachers or pastors not having a job. Like, cause I, I'm a pre- preacher's daughter. Yeah. My dad had a job. 
you know, so God is God will allow you to have both jobs. <laughs> and that's why a lot of people are, are a lot of people are meant to have a job. A lot of people, believe yes. it or not, I believe that every minister need to have a job. Yeah. But when you think or you believe, okay, your your ministry is bringing a lot of income. Okay, I want to stay home. Yeah, you know that's why a lot of people stay home. You know, cause but if if your ministry is not bringing a lot of that income. You know, scamming people like that. I don't, I don't, believe, I don't, I don't think that person should quit. Nobody should judge this woman until you are in her shoe. Then you yeah. can speak on that. Yeah, I mean, she's coming from a lot already, and then she, you don't know where she's coming from. Man. Yeah, she, she's living the lavish mm. life. You know, to yeah. be honest with you, you know, I believe that. You know, all that, what she was saying. Hey, the Lord want me to shop. He yeah. want me to. Because there's money. So there's money. 150000 yeah. a year. You know, some people would say it's not a, a lot. But yeah. me as a truck driver, that's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot. You know, you know especially well, back in the, those times. Yeah. Yeah. So, like. If you can if you can uh, work on that right now, at least it might be like almost 500 or a million. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm. This ain't gonna work. Uh-uh. When, you, when you talk about adversity, <laughs> Ooh, Jesus, think about it. She figured mad all over again. <laughs> Listen, we're getting ready to have some intense moment. That was great. That was great. I I, I love it. She keeps it real. Yeah, she keeps that. it. She kept it real. The, I love the, the truth in her. Yeah, you know, a lot of people will fake it and struggle, but. At the same time, uh, I believe that there is nothing God cannot do. Yeah. Uh, if truly God calls you, hey, stop. A lot of people, yes, God mm. tell uh, tells a lot of people to quit their job and do full time ministry. Yeah. You know, yes, if God said that to you, make sure it's from God, yes. not your flesh, or maybe somebody's telling you. Right. Because I have had people say, hey, quit job or do this. You know, do full time ministry. But I know. My capacity, I know. Yes, I believe there is uh, God can do everything, anything. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, we have to use wisdom. Bills are still coming. Yeah. That's what people need to understand. Is like, yeah. you know, yeah. If you want to be a, be in full time ministry, do that. But do it with honesty and make yeah. sure that you can pay your light bills. Yeah. Make sure you can pay the water bill and yeah. the roof that is over your head. And if you have a a wife and children to take care of, you know, you know, you got to be smart. You know, yeah. cause I remember when I, you know, like I said, I'm a preacher daughter. I remember my dad telling my mom that, you know, he wanted to do full-time ministry. Did he ever do that? No, he never did it. Bills comes in. Bills was coming in and, you know? uh, he did have his own company. He had his own construction company and, uh, he, the Lord told him to let it go because it's, 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 uh, conflicting with ministry, but he still had a job and he also did ministry, but he quit the, his own business. And, um, you know, that's what he felt he needed to do. But, you know, he never went broke. He never begged people for money. Um, but, yeah, um, she's just keeping it real. And uh, yeah. hopefully, you know, obviously he must have listened to her because they still yeah. happy as ever yeah. sitting on that couch. Yeah. We love yeah. you guys, man. This is what we want to share with you guys. If you're not following this page, cool couple, please do. Yes, please. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.